Well, there's a whole lot of buzz as we gear up for one of the biggest nights in the music industry. The 2024 Grammy Awards will air right here on Coin 6 Sunday night. And while the ceremony happening in L.A., the Rose City will be represented as a Portland State University educator Cody Raven Morris, one of only 10 finalists up for the Music Educator Award. And our Joelle Jones sat down with the 35-year-old Grammy nominee at she, she must be to the moon. How exciting. She really is. And for someone so talented, she's very humble about this nomination. You know, from growing up in foster care to sleeping in her car while she's earning her degree to conducting choirs across the state and now being nominated for a Grammy. She says music has been there every step of the way, and it's her mission to share the power of song with others. It is my life's purpose to touch as many lives through the vehicle of music, and that's what I'm striving to do. A local Grammy nominee making big waves. Cody Raven Morris is the Hinckley Assistant Professor of Choir, Music Education, and Social Justice at Portland State University. And while she's only been in the Rose City for three years, she's found her rhythm, with her innovative teaching methods already catching the eyes of the Recording Academy, out of nearly 2,000 educators nominated. Only 10 finalists. That's amazing. How does it feel? I remember the phone call that I received on December 1st that informed me that I was in the top 10, and um, I just stood on the phone and cried. And to have not only myself, but my students, my institution be amplified and to have the work and my mission of what music and education do be amplified on a large platform, it's an opportunity like no other. Good news train coming down the track. Good news, good news coming down the track. Morris says she didn't know where Portland was when she took the job in 2021. Still, her bond with students was clear just from a few minutes watching her classroom. I asked what they thought of this honor. Oh, they're like, elated. <laughs> their, their reaction every time I see them in a the hallway, it's not Professor Morris. Is that the Grammy nominated <laughs> Professor Cody Raven Morris? And lift up two, one, two. In addition to teaching, Morris founded Being Human Together, or BHT, which aims to use music to help connect communities and further conversations about mental health, systemic oppression, and other challenging topics. Here at Portland State, Being Human Together has three branches community, neighbors, and youth. It's with our neighbors initiative that we are working on a houseless choir. One, two, <gasps> chatty, it's chatty, it's chatty, it's chatty. Coming from a place of experience, Morris says she earned the first half of her undergraduate degree while sleeping in her car and knows the potential power music has to heal vulnerable communities. And one of my favorite tunes is, when you were born, you cried and the world rejoiced. Live your life so that when you die, the world cries and you rejoice. We've been singing since we were born and people just need to return to that. Her work also helped organize BHT's first youth summit last spring, offering local high school students a day of musical learning and community building, using song to address the issues most important to them. She says win or lose her family here in Portland and across the globe will celebrate this accolade with her every step of the way. Everyone is in my corner and they're cheering for me. Um, and this beautiful new family that I have here at Portland State, uh, to quote one of my students, Apollo, who said, win or lose, we're going to have a party. And that's the plan. Definitely the plan. And we are keeping our fingers crossed for her this Sunday. The winner will get $10,000 and a matching grant for their music program. And again, you can watch the Grammys right here on Coin 6 Sunday night at 5. Mm, I, yeah, I, I know you said you had so much in that story. Joelle was actually having to cut stuff out because it was running. So yeah. she had so much to say about her. Yeah, she really, I mean, she hosts a radio show. She does so much. It's just she's a great person. And we're yeah. really excited to see her honored in this way. Oh. Yeah. Best of luck to her. It, it, Joel, that was yeah. one of the best stories we've run in a mm -hmm. long time. Just so inspirational. Thank We're all going to be pulling for this Sunday. Fingers yeah. crossed. All right. Thanks. Well,